Welcome to the Script Filter. This video is your quick start introduction. The app opens to the dashboard page. This page gives us an overview of important aspects of the script, such as line count percentages for the gender and the race of characters, the percentage of dialogue that takes place in day or night and exterior or exterior locations, the general intensity of the dialogue, the top 12 concepts of the script in order of significance, the expected MPAA rating and the total of various instances of profanity, violence, sex, and drug use. There are portrait and landscape views for each page. One way to access the individual profile pages is to swipe left or right. As we swipe to the left, first we have the character profile, which displays all the characters in order of significance. Each sortable column displays a character's critical data, such as significance value, number of sentences spoken, number of times mentioned, intro page, and more. Also, the data from every profile page can be shared as CSV files for spreadsheets. Next is the script page. The script is displayed in one endless scroll separated into pages by blue dashed lines and page numbers. Double tap on the screen to make the floating control panel disappear and reappear. Here we have the sex and violence profile which displays a quick view of instances of profanity, drugs, sex, and violence throughout the script. At the bottom is the Highlight button, which will highlight all the instances on the script page for easy location. Next is the Scene Profile, displaying each scene heading with important data about the scene in sortable columns. Page number, interior-exterior, location, time of day, the number of lines, the number of pages, and the scene significance, which is the percentage of importance that each scene has to the storyline. With the scene significance value, we can find the scenes that have the most dialogue that can be cut without harming the overall storyline. The scene data profile displays all the characters in the scene with data about their significance to the scene, along with the top eight concepts of the scene. The location statistics profile lists the percentages of pages, dialogue lines, and action sentences that are in exterior or exterior and day or night scenes. The location profile displays each location of the script in lists of interior day, interior night, exterior day, and exterior night, displaying important data about each scene in sortable columns. The concept profile displays all the concepts of the movie in order of significance with connotation values for each concept as they apply to the story. These concepts are mainly used for summarization purposes, but they can also give a feel for what the script is about and the dialogue intensity. Now we've made it back to the dashboard page. Each of these displays are shortcut buttons to individual profile pages. The title display takes us to the script page. The rating display takes us to the sex and violence profile. The character line count display takes us to the character profile. The location statistics display takes us to the location statistics profile. And the top concepts display takes us to the concept profile. From any profile page, tap the script filter logo at the top to go back to the dashboard page. Tap the Concept Intensity Meter to see a list of concept intensity values of other movies, just for reference. Tap the COG button, and you can show or hide any of the profile pages, just in case there are some pages that you rarely use. You can also customize the order of the pages for convenient swiping. The Bookshelf icon displays and accesses your library of scripts that you've analyzed. Okay, that's it for your quick start introduction. And remember, if you need more detailed information on the functionality of each individual profile page, there are more short videos below that will help you. Thanks for choosing the script filter.